Songwriting started for me when I was probably 12 years old and I wrote a song for this little school play and I think we got disqualified because everyone thought that my mom wrote the song and, and the judges didn't believe that I actually wrote it. Um, it was for Odyssey of the Mind. I wrote this funny song about a blue whale in the ocean and I think that's the first song I ever wrote. And uh, then I went on to college and I took a songwriting class and that really taught me the fundamentals of songwriting. And then after that, I actually went to a John Mayer concert in Roanoke, Virginia. Followed him after the show to a little restaurant and introduced myself. We had an awkward exchange. At the end of the night, he told me about this book that he read that was really influential to him. Um, it was literally just called Writing Better Lyrics. And I remember reading that book and just learning so much and, and falling in love with how important the lyric and the story is. Because before that, I didn't really care. I was more into rock music and where, where I didn't really listen to the lyrics and know. And that kind of turned me to country music. And that's when I fell in love with writing country songs. So we wrote Strip It Down out at Luke's farm. Um, he took us around in his truck and drove us around through it, the river and through all of his hunting fields and showed us his, his streams where he has trout stocked. He lives on the most beautiful farm I've ever seen in my life. And we had written, I think, two songs that morning with him. And we were kind of downstairs just having a little bite to eat. And Luke was like, you want to go try another song? We were like, yeah, let's go do it. And so we went up and Luke grabbed his guitar and he literally just started you know, strumming these chords. And then he just, he started going, let it fade to black, let me run my fingers down your back. He literally just started like stream of conscience. All this out, me and John were looking at each other like, oh my gosh, this is amazing. So we got our computer, started like catching all these things that he was saying and just writing, writing, writing. And about 25 minutes into this, Luke was kind of like, all right, y'all, you want to get back together on this one? And me and John looked at each other, we're like, uh, uh sure. Because we knew this was like, this was the one. And so at that point, we had literally all of this material and pretty much, pretty much Luke just wrote the whole song in just bits. And we went back and pieced it all together and it became Strip It Down.